My name is Mary. And I'm making America great again. Today is Friday, May 11th. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. Attention freshmen, sophomores, and juniors. Petitions <clears throat> for class officers are now available for class advisors. Uh, if, you are a, if you are a class of 2019, next year's seniors, you may pick up petitions from Mr. Geyer in 149 or Mrs. Eliza Gonchis in 101. If you are going to be a junior next year, you may pick up a petition from Mrs. Schubert in room 209. If you are in class of 2021, you may pick up a form from Mr. Shortest in 109 or Mr. Hershey in 309. Petitions are due Thursday, May 17th, so don't delay. If you have any questions, please see any of the class advisors. Don't forget to pick up your yearbook today during lunch. <coughs> pick up your pre-ordered copy at lunch or bring along $80, tax included. Cash or check for the few limited extra copies available. Don't be the only one without a book no and tax. buy your copy today. Books are also available from Mrs. Seifel in the attendance window. There will be an introductory meeting of the Mountaineer Robotics Club next Wednesday, May 16th, immediately after school in room 320. Uh, that was her photo. Anyone interested in participating or learning more about Robotics Club is welcome to attend <laughs> students who have taken IED or POE or especially in demand. So please come to the meeting to find out about our club. Any questions, see Mr. Myers or send him a message. Sophomores are reminded to get their money and order forms in for their official class t-shirt. Deadline is today, class of 2020. Give this to your homeroom teacher. Artists who had work in the District Art Show at the Public Library can now pick up their masterpieces from Ms. Uh, Ms. Yeo and Mr. Hershey. Please do this this week as they need to find room to breathe in the art studio. Now over to Seth with the real news. You know, the dishonest media, they'll say, Grr, Mondays. Okay, so for anybody that's asking, I am uh, I'm Adam, like the first man alive. If if he were part of the band Oasis, so yes, that's how this goes. And this is Nate. I'm a, I'm anyway, a gamer. today we're gonna sing the news. A group of mainly Democratic senators has called for a vote on the FCC's decision to overturn net neutrality. The group consists of all 47 Democratic senators and the Independence Bernard Senators of Vermont, Angus King, and May of Maine. 
and Republican Senator Susan Collins, also of Maine. They will attempt to hold the vote before the end of next week. Even if the measure passes through the Senate, it is unlikely if they will receive sufficient support in the House of Representatives. Ah, that's too hard. On this day in 1934, a massive dust storm sent millions of tons of topsoil to, from the Great Plains region to the east, as far as New York, part of the larger event called the Dust Bowl. These series of dust storms were caused by both dry farming and because of the overproduction of wheat during World War I. The Dust Bowl had the unfortunate timing of occurring during the worst years of the Great Depression, but farming practices were altered across the country to keep the number of dust storms at a minimum. Yeah, farmers. Now back to the main couch. Here is a good video about the Share Center. Share video. <laughs> All right, for today, for lunch, we have mac and cheese with a whole grain roll and margarine. Breaded chicken patty with whole grain roll. Meatball calzone. Ham, turkey, cheese, flatbread. Chicken Caesar salad. Stewed tomatoes and sauce. Seasoned green beans. Fresh cauliflower dip applesauce. <laughs> Fresh fruit or... or slushy. Now over to Gerald with sports. In sports resorts, I am not marrying Gaston. I am still trapped in this castle. <laughs> Boys and girls, track and field athletes who are going, who are not going to districts, track and field uniform collection will be Monday, May 14th at the middle school gym. You will all, you will need all pieces of the uniform, and they should be laundered. Boys, come to the back entrance by the locker room at 3:15 p.m. to turn in your uniform. Girls will be getting your section champ photo taken at 3:30 p.m. Then turning in your uniforms after that. Attention anyone planning to play football in the fall, there will be an informational meeting on Tuesday, May 15th in Coach Miller's room, room 122, immediately after school. It is important that you make arrangements to attend. We will start spring camp on Monday, May 21st. See Coach Miller with any questions. Attention all current juniors, sophomores, and freshmen interested in playing fall sports. Sign-ups will be on Schoology again this year. Sign-ups will be available from May 1st through May 18th. Sign up today. Don't put it off. Fall sports include boys and girls soccer, football, field hockey, girls tennis, girls volleyball, co-ed golf, and co-ed cross country. Today in sports, track and field will travel to the league match at Hemfield. Now back to the main desk. No couch. Uh, listen up. Are you going to prom this Saturday? Yes. yes. Then this is for you. No way. The care yeah, yeah, way. Uh, the caretakers of the yeah, F and course have, have invited us onto the grounds for picture taking before the main event. Meet up with other classmates and just enjoy the day. We'll see you at the course day between 3 o'clock and 5 o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Seniors, it's time to celebrate your future direction decisions. You spent the majority of your senior year trying to decide what your future holds and where you would like to be next year. Nope. All seniors who have made the decision to further their education by attending college, technical or trade school, art or nursing, or who have enlisted in any branch of the armed services are invited to show EHS where you will be continuing your schooling next year. You can email your counselor, send them a Schoology message, or stop by the counseling office to drop your counselor a note about where you are headed next year, college or military. Your picture will be posted on the bulletin board outside of the counseling office for everyone to see. Don't delay. Well, that's it for us Last today. Oh, <laughs> have, have a, a Trumptastic day. Have a great it's the right way to do a day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.